Hey, Foot Clan, the fantasy footballers here. Are you excited for the 2022 I season? I sure am, Andy. <laughs> I'm pretty excited. Oh, yeah. Uh, you got to join us each and every day from August through the end of the year. We got a show every day of the week. And we thought we would hop on here and yes. share some of our favorite moments from last year. Enjoy. <laughs> let, me, let me take you into the mind of Big Ben right now. Snap the ball. Cheeseburger. <laughs> <laughs> yes, that's exactly what he's thinking. So mean. I think that's part of the problem. That's so mean. <laughs> double, double. <laughs> yes, I'll take onions. Grill them? Sure. Oh, shoot. Throw I mean, the ball. <laughs> I'm surprised you can't hear Al laughing as loud as he's laughing from behind the producer's desk. It also appears that Christian McCaffrey is not at practice again today. <laughs> Come on, what's wrong with your body? <laughs> Sorry, go ahead, continue. <laughs> when Logan Thomas comes back, he's just going into that full-time role and will be, you know, a, I feel like a, a weekly top five start. I agree, and I do plan on inheriting a number of roles on Thanksgiving Day. Oh, for, for what it's yeah. worth. So much dinner butter. <laughs> dinner butter? Dinner rolls, butter Is that different than lunch rolls. butter? Oh, dinner butter is way different. <laughs> dinner butter is always it's, whipped. It's, uh, well, you know. Din dinner butter is a step up. It's left. Oh, yeah. You don't want lunch butter. To you ever had that. breakfast butter? Breakfast butter is cold and hard. It's dumb. Oh, wow. Yeah. Really? No. <laughs> I no, no. This is all just made up because I said dinner butter. <laughs> but uh, I love me some rolls. Uh, and that's the, that's the, we need to focus there. And obviously takes the pants, Panthers out of that market. In, takes the uh, pants. Takes the pants right out of the market. <laughs> takes the pants right off the market. Um, which, hot, which this last weekend in Arizona yeah. did that. They were right out. We had to dress up yes. for Easter, and it was like, can I strip on the way to the car going back from church? Yeah, how quick when I get home can these uh, – why did I not wear my rip-off jeans? That was <laughs> the only question I had is, why don't these jeans Velcro on the side? So, pants-free zone, you were saying – we took a look and redid the rookie rankings. Um, so it, the the whole dynasty pan, uh, pass has been uh, updated. Was that, was that a, pants? The, a pants again? <laughs> got pants on the mind, apparently. Old dynasty pants. Put them on. Old, yeah, Put can't if stop you, thinking about pants. <laughs> <laughs> if you get the ultimate draft kit plus, you get the dynasty pants, and those are the best pants you'll ever put on. <laughs> now I'm just I'm just sharing. This piece of information, I didn't invent it, so oh, this don't is get a great, mad at me. Great stat. But back in 2000, not only were you 18, mm -hmm. but you at that time weighed the same as Tutu Atwell does today. Oh, fantastic! Which, which right now, present day Jason weighs 1.84 tutus. I, I think we should start. <laughs> I think this we should have a movement. You know, we got stones over the sea. You got pounds here. Right. We should go tutus. Okay, so you're at one. I am one point eight four two. And I wanna... refuse to believe you were a you, you were a one sixty five when you were eighteen. No, I was not one sixty five okay. at eighteen. I knew this stat was egregious. How many two twos would you like to weigh? <laughs> like, if you work hard, how many you go into one point five two twos? Uh, so you're a telling two -two me is a two two two? He's how much? He's one sixty five. Uh, I would like to weigh one point two one two twos. <laughs> so I've got point six two twos to lose. I entered the DraftKings Millie Maker for Thursday night. The showdown. My lineup did very well. I cashed. I think I got uh, 30 bucks. <laughs> I won. You sure did. <laughs> oh, man. I, I'm just shocked. If it weren't for Jason, I'm not sure I, I take down the Millie Maker. Because, oh. because, so I'm giving him one-sixth of my winnings. Ooh, all right. <laughs> but the second headline here, guys, I'm the same person. That you know and love. I just because I took down the Millie you, Maker. You have been incredibly the, humble. We I'm showed the up. Same person. We hey, showed I, up. To I lattes. hate to interrupt, guys, but oh, Al, a Andy had a rush delivery that just showed up. He said oh, it's really? important. Okay. Oh. Anyways, no. I'm the same guy. <laughs> Got a new hat. I'm the same guy I've always been, and I just want you to know that. I'm, I'm quite, stay, quite the fancy hat. I'm gonna oh, stay, I'm well. gonna stay humble. <laughs> Oh boy, Lambo! Last what? week, what? Last With week, Justin I did, Fields. Yeah, I did not recommend the strategy of mooning your opponent. This week, 
I'm pants down, baby. Uh, with Justin Fields in, Cheeks I'm willing out. to. I'm willing to plug bread pudding. <laughs> bread. Oh no! Don't call that the bread no, pudding. That's not okay. <laughs> not okay. <laughs> pants up, bread pudding. Pants down is a Mooney. Um, we are. Is that is that bread pudding? <laughs> oh no! Here's the thing. Uh, Darnell Sorry, Mooney. Now be, ser- now be serious, let's, Jason. Let's be real. Be, be an analyst. Let's from be- uh, my bread pudding. Man, I might not order bread pudding anymore. <laughs> At this point, that dessert is over. <laughs> it's ruined. Um, hmm. It was a heavyweight matchup. The Green Bay Packers were taking on the Arizona Cardinals. Currently, or as of last night, they were undefeated. The Packers took them down twenty-four to twenty-one. Oh, don't you? Oh, oh, yeah, baby. Are you kidding go me back, right now? Go. Take the, it down the undefeated Arizona Cardinals in the bird's nest. Unbelievable. Boom, this shakalaka. Is, boom oh. shakalaka. Oh, man. What is that? You are so fired. Yeah. Al Borland, you are so fired. Get this off our show. I this can't is stop him. I can't stop him. What here. just happened? We got also, hijacked. Thank you guys for taking me to the game last night. Much what? appreciated. Yeah, well, it was a great departing gift for you and your employment here. It was fantastic. That considerate severance. Brooks is back in studio today, and he will be sitting by our megalophone. And uh, when they call, he will pick it up and confirm that, yes, we do want to be included now, in the Guinness Book of World Records. Would the Records. megalophone be a big shark phone or, or a seashell phone? It is, phone? unfortunately, an, an awkwardly shaped shark phone. <laughs> It is not do comfortable you, to do talk. You talk into the mouth or the anus. You, no, you no, listen. Oh my gosh. <laughs> you, you talk, talk into the, the tail. The, yeah, I which, mean, the I mean, yeah, that's the anus. Um, if you're you, talking you, into the tail. We all know what you're talking into, right? But we don't <laughs> say it. <laughs> At least say Adam Gase. I mean, come on. Oh my goodness. You listen through the, the through the mouth and the teeth. Number you, two. You're oh. talking into the number two. Yeah, I mean, either you're talking to it or you're listening to it. It's a lose lose situation. I feel like a, a house of cards right now. I didn't know sharks had. You didn't Everybody, know. Has, everyone poops. Uh, Megalowall.com to join and uh, play along with us. I know I'm going to be in one of those leagues, oh. and the winner of the Megalowall gets in next year's listener league. It's over, guys. It's over. 722 oh. days. Congratulations, New York. Of septic sludge in New York City. You made it. The Adam Gaze. I mean, you, you started it, to be fair. like Yeah, we all knew this before you signed him. <laughs> I'm talking to the city oh. like it's their We're fault. We're flushing it away. It's over. 722 days of Adam Gaze. Yeah, you, take, a, you need a big flush. It's a long flush, it sounds. Yeah, you got to you gotta do that thing where you hold the lever up mm-hmm. just to make sure that more water is coming through. Two cycles of water. Yeah, clear it out. Naeem Hines and J.D. McKissick, they, they fro-yo together. Those guys hang out. They exist to give you eye rolls when you draft the so number they, one in the room. They share the the frozen yogurt, and then they they cackle like, "See how many touches I stole." <laughs> <When Antonio gets. laughs> it's just hard to look at Naeem. Ha- Why are they goblins? <laughs> oh, they're I mean they're goblins because they're gobbling up all his targets. Yeah, that's not bad. That's not bad. Um, both players. Here's what I know. Like, <laughs> that's exactly what he says every time he runs out as, on the field on third down he, when he passes Jonathan as Taylor. He's high fiving him. Yes. They, they, they switch like get in there, but <laughs> also my voice could not do a goblin right now. <laughs> and so I think I'm going to ask both producers to share in the mailbag drop, and I think oh, I pay Merry, them enough to do so. Merry Christmas. <laughs> Mailbag. Mailbag. <laughs> it was loud. That's great. I Thank love you, guys. you guys. I feel like we got some harmony in there. That wasn't bad. Uh, what is? It wasn't good, but it wasn't bad. Instagram question from uh, Zonda Panda. Zanda Panda. Uh, around what age would a wide receiver in Dynasty be considered end of career? Well, I mean, it depends on... Why are you laughing? I, I didn't hear any of the question because all I could think of was Zonda Panda. <laughs> <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. I don't know what's wrong with me, guys, but... Um, That's a good band name. Zonda Panda? Yeah. Yeah. Maybe an, definitely an EDM. For sure. Tim Patrick, Fireball Jones. Yeah, signed baby. a three-year, $34 million extension. Ka-ching. 
Let's talk about what that means. Well, it means the future of Cortland Sutton is probably not as a Bronco. Wait, That's, did he? Is this? You didn't see that? Just come through. It just came through. Wait. What? Breaking news. Rewind. Do you want to? Do you want to? Uh, yeah. Let, let me. Let me. Cold let me, takes. Let me. <laughs> freezing cold <laughs> takes. I don't know that there's ever been a quicker cold take. Uh, let me break this it news. Lit- three the, minutes ago, it the happened. The Broncos reached an agreement on an extension for wide receiver Cortland Sutton, four years, sixty million dollars, with thirty-four point nine million guaranteed. Take <laughs> that, Fireball Jones! Wow. Do we have tight ends to pick up, Brooks? Not really. That's, that's why, what I'm learning. Well, that's why these names are here. What about Max Williams? You want to chase? He's a 0% rostered and just had 7 for 94 for Arizona. Max Williams at least gets the Jacksonville Jaguars where you could easily, uh, you know, throw all over him. But no, I'm not. I'm not. I, I want to bring up Pat Fryermuth because, oh. the, because the Muth was loose. <laughs> Um, he had four. That's for the th- only reason you want to bring him <laughs> that's up. It. That's he, the only reason. He did not do enough to no. warrant a, a, a pickup. Absolutely, he did not. But the muth is luth, <laughs> and say it with me, people. You'll have fun. He watch, luth. watch the Steelers game, and when Pat Fryer Muth gets luth, you're gonna enjoy it. All right, let's hit back to the voicemail. Hey guys, what's your take on Jacoby Myers? I think he's gonna be the best pass catching option on New England this year taking over for that Julian Edelman role. And, oh, you know, ah, <laughs> dang it. <laughs> Messed it up. Oh, <laughs> man, that's great. <laughs> that, Brooks, gr- you left that in there? <laughs> yeah, I did this time. Oh, get oh I'm sorry, my man. Here's what's crazy. That, th- that bus was driven exclusively by Brooks. <laughs> Brooks <laughs> backed the money truck up and said, I'll do what I want. Well, are you guys ready for our brand new Dynasty Download oh, segment? Oh, am I? We got new graphics for it, too. Woo! Dynasty Download. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Good job on that one, Mike. What? That's, hold on a minute. It's a little tamer than your usual drop. Yeah, yeah that's different. What is? What is this? Why are? Why have I been conspired against? Why did I work on a Sunday so that we <laughs> could put that why into the I podcast? Work? Look, I have your real drop. I have your. Here's here's the truth. Now the graphic. Did you of, like the graphic? The graphic of Jay Grizz playing dueling banjos on a guitar for some reason. Uh, and then break dance. Well, look, I, I, <laughs> got, I got breaking news for you. That was actually me on the guitar. Oh. Uh, I, I we, we knew that this segment was coming quick, and I didn't, uh, I'll be honest, I didn't expect you to work on a Sunday. And I knew we had it on Tuesday. So I'm I wa- committed. I wasn't sure if, that you were going to have it in time, and I wanted to fill in the gap for you. So I grabbed my guitar, and I threw it up there, and I got it. I got it going. Dynasty download. It's almost as good as Mike's <laughs> usual ones. That forest in the background? I mean, it really pumps you up. You know? I thought it's this like... would be the official segment, but Mike, you did come through, and I'll hit the button now. Dynasty download. <laughs> the graphics are way better on yours, Andy. <laughs> what am I doing? Uh, you're, you're having a good time. <laughs> <laughs> that, is, that is borderline not safe for work. All right, Dynasty <laughs> Download. Goodness gracious. Make We're, sure to subscribe on YouTube. Show. We're going to be spending some time. We thought <laughs> we thought it'd be fun to surprise you, Mike. Oh, well, I've I've surprised by both. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Wheel of shame. Spin the wheel. All right, so we got Fedora, the Blue Man. That was Jester me. Hat. Hunter Hat. Oh man, please don't be that. Oh, oh it's that. <laughs> it's Fish Face. It what says is Fish Face. Fish Face. Can I get, get it on? on? YouTube.com slash the Fantasy Footballers. Oh, that's a snug fit. Oh, ho. can you breathe? <laughs> Um, yes, but I don't know. I don't know how this will play for a podcast. Oh, it sounds, it sounds oh, great! It's, it sounds like you would. You're speaking underwater. Okay, well, that's what it feels like. I'm breathing too. How, how is oh, this? this is the worst by ten miles. There's <laughs> never been anything this bad. So hit us with a profile, real yeah, quick. Yeah, I need the profile picture, Jay. Turn to the left. <laughs> oh man, Be I'm in that great. stupid situation in our dynasty league where I'm C- I'm the CMC manager. And I'd like to just tuck Chuba on my bench. Mm-hmm. 
But every time I try to send an offer, I get some crap back, man. Hard to tuck a chuba. They're trying. <laughs> Very <laughs> nice. Um, yes. So, yeah. Um, what was I saying? <laughs> uh, the trade offers to get chuba are not. Not going well. Not going well. They, he wants a lot. So he doesn't want to let me tuck a chuba. No. No, it's difficult. Which, I mean, that's tough, man. <laughs> and that's the end. Oh, that's All right. how we finish. <laughs> That was a footballer's episode if I've ever Ooh, seen doggy. one. Thank What's you that phone number, Jason? 302-464-TFFB. Goodbye. Thank you for listening to another episode of the Fantasy Footballers Podcast. Join our fantasy football community on jointhefoot.com and follow us on Twitter at the FFBallers.